press start! And welcome to the outside! Welcome back, everybody! Hello, everyone. This is the outside of the world. It's all green and beautiful. We have a bit of time until our next departure. AKA, as long as you want to fucking stay here. We have no schedule. <laughs> no schedule. It's actually just on you alone. Oh, I, yes. You had it for two episodes. It's your turn. And you got the boss, so... Which are always fun. Okay, so how are you doing, Mr. Nerd Mouse? The business people I'm waiting for haven't arrived yet, so I'm sightseeing. I'm also falling off the bed. Hold on. On the expensive count, of course. As if you have to ask by now. God. I don't know why, but my throat just decided to, uh... Say fuck you. I'm so glad you came up with a good By the way, jump in that pool. It looks, it looks like a really cool, cool place to be right now. <laughs> really cool, cool place to be right now. Yeah, no, go in the pool. <laughs> yeah, sure. Well, then why not? I'll, I'll even take the fucking stairs. I guess I won't take the stairs. Oh, hey, prawns are in the pool. Oh, good. Your swimming pool is unsafe, sir. That is a health violation, and you should be reprimanded severely for it. I'm gonna go into these houses, because these houses are nice. And sometimes you can find hidden shit. Like is this, this. the Obama family's house? Maybe. That's a small-ass uh, house if it is. Yeah, there's not even a bed. Oh, but did you know about this? Wabba jabba 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 jaw! Ooh, treasure chest! Secret back room, we're robbing these people! <laughs> HP trade partner! Drop your- yeah. But gain one HP per attack. Sweet! So lose your attack, but you get HP every time you... Attack, so... <laughs> Woohoo! Really can't explain it more than that. <laughs> All right, let's talk to these guys. This is gonna be a little more of a chatty, chatty kind of episode, I guess. You wouldn't happen to have a train set for sale, would you? A gold one, perhaps? Oh, a train set. I thought you meant like a legit train. Like, could you imagine how fucking solid gold train? <laughs> Wait, hey, hey, Super go Mario Three D. Yeah, World. yeah, Super Mario Three D World has one. Yeah, so. go go to uh, the uh, what is it? The uh, uh, Sp Spixie Kingdom. That's I know it. just the place. Just the place, indeed. We dearly like to find a suitable present for our little bub. Oh, I thought she was gonna keep going. That was oh. all she had. <laughs> hey, mister! I'm gonna get a train set! The coolest one ever invented! I could just have them buy me a real train, but maybe I'll save that for next year. Fucking rich people. <laughs> I could get a real train, but I'll, I'll, I'll deal with a train set. Hold on, I wanna do this. Chubbies! Choo 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 choo. I don't know why this is here. If the star piece is in the hedge, like, why come out the other edge? I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna go into this house because there's a certain someone- And it's- Oh. You dashing, dashing man, you. How dare you show up in my humble abode like this? <laughs> Welcome, you marvelous man. The train journey certainly was thrilling, hmm? I'd fuck you. I'd and just leaves. <laughs> 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 just straight up. I would fuck you. And leaves the house. <laughs> like, how untacked can you get more than that? <laughs> I mean, some girls like the direct approach. I guess that's true, yeah. That's true. I'm just gonna get all the fucking star pieces in this fucking place. You know what they, they all are, huh? They're, like, they're so, like, weirdly hidden. I think they're- no, there's not one here. Like, you would think that this is just, like, a town that you would just, like, hang out in, but it's actually got some pretty decent secrets. Yeah. Also, I like these penguin guys. They're pretty silly. <laughs> Cute. So, lovely house, eh? Yeah, sure. Take your time to soak in all of its majesty. So, are these guys rich? I guess? naturally rich. Don't they live on Shiver Mountain or something from the original Paper Mario? They do. Yeah, so I guess these are like the rich ones of those. I guess. Peep those, the penguin people. You know, when they're not accusing you of murder. That's true, yeah. <laughs> well, it's good to see that we're on their good side, at least. I built it with even the smallest details in mind, making every nook special. Yeah, he built the fucking house with his flippers. That's pretty impressive, actually. He used his flippers as, as hammers. And a uh, screwdriver. Yeah, he didn't use tools. <laughs> yeah, he's flippers. <laughs> just his flippers. Yeah, That's look around outside. That's adorable. Imagine, imagine a penguin just slapping the, <laughs> the, the cement on a brick with his cute little flappers. That is really cute. It's oh, like, that's really cute. Gotta make it nice and pat. And you, like, pat him on the head and you're like, you'll it's do so it, buddy. Cute. He's only on the first brick. Yeah. And then you come back four months later, it's a fucking mansion. You're like, wait a minute. <laughs> Don't judge me, bitch. Wow. <laughs> I guess it's sort of fun to live here. But I can't eat snow cones. Or make a little snowman. Or go ice skating. Or any other stuff I didn't shiver say- Ah! Ah! Nice little cameo there. Don't know what you got till it's gone. True that. 
I like it. I knew there was a Shiver City reference in here somewhere. Oh, yeah. There's another Paper Mario reference that comes after the game. That Boo character. That, that did. Fuck. I don't know how to spoilers, guys. <laughs> I heard Possibly Heights was a quiet place. But there are a lot of turrets, eh? Maybe I should just open up a store, shall it? Fuck. Store. Selling. Shiver. City. Souvenirs. <laughs> that sentence fucked me up, dude. Wow. A store selling Shiver City souvenirs. Try saying that five times fast. A store selling Shiver City souvenirs. A store selling Shiver City souvenirs. A store selling Shiver City souvenirs. Mm. Yeah, you I said sore. You said sore. <laughs> store. Yeah, maybe so. That's hard. It is, yeah. A coupon! Woo! So, actually, we could use that at the hotel here. It counts as an end. Ooh, the Powerpuff Girls! Let's <laughs> the, check them out. The Siblings 3, or whatever they're called. We are the Wandering Girls of Traveling Sisters 3! We are staying in that luxury hotel! Possibly Heights sure is a place for the rich and famous, huh? We're thinking of going to see the Possibly State them next. Heart. 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 What does the girl in the cart say? Oh, yo, she sells pasta. Pasta? Yes. Let's, let's get some fucking pasta, dude. I'm yeah, hungry. Dude, let's do it. Oh, welcome to you! How would you like to buy some high-quality fresh pasta as a parsley souvenir? One package costs 50 coins! <laughs> yeah! Yeah, that's why. Don't buy it. Nah. Come again, okay? She's like waving goodbye, Jesus. Mario's like, I, I fucking would rather spend that money towards my brother's books. I can Jesus. just go to Publix and get it for cheap. Literally! Wait, wait, we have to go to the hotel. Yeah, we gotta do it. It's so fair. It's so cheek and fancy. Are we gonna do the oh, whole- Oh, wait, but we have a friend first! Daddle. Oh my god. <laughs> Tell him! I'm you can't avoid him! I can't. Here you go, Gumbella. I have <laughs> enough of this guy! How does he do it? I'm almost impressed now! He moves at light speed and he always knows where we'll be! Talk about freaky! She's about to, like, I, I walk up to him. actually fuck him. She's about to walk up to him and just fucking grab his stupid-ass sunglasses and break him over her Goomba knee and walk into the hotel <laughs> hospital. No, no, no she's the... starting to get attracted to him, I think. But she's like, I'm almost impressed. I think she's getting the house for him. That Stockholm Syndrome setting in. Even though he didn't really kidnap us, but, you know, it's Stalker Syndrome? Stalkers? <laughs> anyway, let's talk to him. Mario's just well, like, oh yeah, that's him. right, so I thought I talked to him for some reason. Bonjour, monster moustache. So you last as the reception desk is très magnifique. Magnifique? <laughs> magnifique. I shall stay here every night until that heart is mine. I shall not die at all. Oh my god, he's so creepy. <laughs> he's so creepy. He's so creepy. He's so is that Wait, even a girl? That's a... I would never have guessed. I, I, Does she just have like really short hair, or? Oh, 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 they're, they're, oh! You know, I found something interesting on the internet recently. What? That toad girl. This one. Yeah, like any toad hiding behind the desk, actually isn't at that height. Like if she, if they if that toad was to walk out right now, she should be below Mario's hat, right? Yeah. Turns out, if you actually hack the game and turn the camera, you could see that her sprite is actually elevated a bit to be above the desk. Huh. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, put that on screen. It's pretty neat, huh? Whoa. You know. It makes sense, too. Yeah, let's go to the hotel. Cool. All right. Refresh our shit. This is a Royal Poshley... Fucking hell of words. Royal Poshley Park Tower. We promise a comfortable stay in the lap of luxury, the pinnacle of poshness. This is one of Trump's many locations. <laughs> Fucking hell. A room for the night costs a mere 30 coins. Would you care to stay? Sure, I'll stay. Yeah, sure, why not? It's pretty cheap. I mean, the pasta outside Yeah, it's fucking 50 30 coins. coins with f fucking pasta that I could boil in like 15 <laughs> minutes. It's probably ramen or some shit. Yeah. <laughs> Fresh pasta, it says. Fresh pasta, it says. Yeah, use the ink coupon. She chucks the fucking plastic brick at you. <laughs> <laughs> you won't buy it? Thunk. Actually can be used as a battering weapon. We have prepared the penthouse on the top floor Holy for you. shit, for 30 coins? I trust it will be to your liking. Please make yourself at home. Yo, but honestly, this is the slowest fucking elevator in the history of elevators. Okay, real talk. I went on a cruise recently. Yeah? And, um, it was for my, uh, graduation. It was a graduation present to me. Awesome. For my parents. Awesome. And I ate at a five-star restaurant. And? For free. And? It's incredible! 
That's so cool, I had a, dude. I had a complimentary New York strip. Complimentary. Complimentary. Because there's a list of restaurants, right? I mean, you could pay extra to get access to, like, that really high-end restaurants. But this they already like the have... This like of the five-star. Yeah, but the, it's a legit five-star restaurant. It's like, people were dressed all nice and shit. And it was free. I mean, you know, you have to pay the crew for the cruise, but... It was a part of the cruise package. It's complimentary. <laughs> five-star restaurant. <laughs> I'm not... That, that's true. That's fucking ridiculous, dude. What fucking cruise package did yeah, you get? I had a New York cheesecake for free. That's incredible. That's it so was the, cool. Literally, it's the best fucking food ever. New York cheesecake? Oh my god. If I ever get I, the blessing the food. to try it, I will. Because I had like, and they had like steak and french fries. I, I had wine for free. Fuck, dude. That's so cool. Go on a cruise. Go on a cruise. You might think it's lame, right? You think it's lame because you're on a I boat. don't actually. I really want to go on a cruise. It's a lot of fun. I hear that. There's a lot. so people think, oh, I'll be stuck on a boat all day. No, 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 no. You, there's so much shit to do. There was like three water slides. One that's like a two slide, and one where you drop vertically. Oh shit! And there's like this, this like obstacle course where you can like, there's like a plank that leads out to the ocean, and you're just dangling above the ocean via cable. Holy shit! There's a mini golf course. Yeah. A movie theater. Fucking hell, dude. All these shows. It's, it's like, you might think it's expensive at like a thousand dollars a piece. Or, actually, no, it was 500 for us. Each. Nice. So, yeah. Go on a cruise. Specifically Norwegian Cruise Line. I'm going to plug them because they're fucking amazing. What was it? Norwegian? Norwegian Cruise Line. NCL. I awesome will people. pass that because actually we're planning on going on a cruise. See the juggler. You got to see the juggler. Yeah, we the, will. The comedy juggler, he is amazing. <laughs> you, we will. I forget his name, God. Uh, and just, oh, so many amazing shows. So many amazing. Oh, and the stand up comedians. They're great too. Watch the stand up comedians. I will. They're amazing. That's anyway, <laughs> sleep well, sir. Yes. We saw the gourmet prepared meal prepared by the famous Z chef Zesty on the table. Ah. You mean the one that I like. That lives in shithole rogue port? <laughs> yeah, the one that I like. Crushed your contacts. Yeah. Were you satisfied with our service, sir? I mean, I just kind of slept. We look forward to your next visit. All right, cool. Ooh. Dude, get the fuck away from that omelet. It's mine. You hear me? No, I don't want to talk to you. It's mine. Fucking mine. <laughs> we first step on the omelet to restore our dominance. <laughs> anyway, let's and get then to... And piss on him. <laughs> <laughs> let's get to the Posse Sanctum, shall we? Yeah, let's do it. It's actually kind of funny because it's just like the same thing as a honey shroom. Like, no joke. Oh, that's funny. Like, look. Oh. Oh. Well, um, it doesn't hurt to I mean, have. it was for free, so I'm not going to complain, but it's just funny to me. Wait, let me... Uh, no, okay. We're good. I thought I missed the Starbucks, but I think we're good. God, now it's just... Now that I, I talked about the cruise, I just want to gush about it more. Cause it's so, <laughs> oh, God. I've wanted to go on the cruise for the longest time, but it, like, it's expensive. It's a long time, too. The big thing is time, because now we're just getting so busy. Yeah. And you can't... Like, I can't go with my parents and not bring Jocelyn, and just and vice versa. Jocelyn yeah. can't go. Like, we have to go together as a family. Yeah, I was out to sea for about six days. How Did you get seasick at all? Uh, No. It, oh, that's the, good. The cruise is actually very smooth. You, you don't even notice it. That's good. It may be not pretty to look at, but I get pretty stressed out. Like, really bad, eh? Dude. Fucking same. But walking barefoot in the grass like this makes me feel much better. You betcha. I might take that advice. No, I won't, because we have nothing in Florida but ants on the fucking ground. <laughs> oh. God help me. I... Part of me wants to legit move up north for medical school just for the better climate. <laughs> I'm not even kidding. Well, I'm... It's not that great. I mean, just for the fact that, like, literally everything I hate about climate in general is here. <laughs> I don't mind heat, but bugs galore, and the grass is just nothing but... Bugs. Shitty bugs in St. <laughs> Augustine. Yeah. <laughs> so, there you go. It's not a very natural facilitated place you know no you the only real time that you can go out and enjoy the weather without getting fucking assaulted by bugs <laughs> is like during the winter when they're dead <laughs> right so, which is very unfortunate because i fucking love going outside but i fucking hate 
bugs, especially wasps. I actually have spexophobia, which is a phobia of wasps. Like, I got diagnosed for that. I gotta tell you a story from my work. But first, people ask me if I get tired of walking the same route every day. And I say, no way, Jose! Because it's a bit, di a bit different every day, you know? I'm not the same as I was yesterday. Neither are you. Even the town changes. I like her, she's cool. And I'll never see another day just like today. So treat each day like it is. Unique! That's some really, like, awesome advice, dude. What do you say? Uh, oh, and hey there! Possibly had to share nice and warm, huh? Yeah, I can really dig it here. Cold places make me sneeze. Dude. Okay, so story time about wasps. Okay, yeah, go ahead. So, at work, sometimes I have to do a shift called host where you clean shit and you, uh... You, Wait, uh, which work is this? You've had a lot of jobs. See, uh, this, this is a, this is an adventure island. Okay. And uh, you uh, you clean things and you do trash and you know you keep the facility nice and tidy, right? Basically, yeah. First of all, bees love trash. Oh hell yeah. Oh, do they love their trash? Oh hell yeah. And they won't leave you alone. But they don't sting you, so hey, that's nice. But well, bees are usually wasps are still around. Yeah. All the time. Yeah. If I go near a dumpster, there is a wasp waiting yep. right there. Looking violently at me. Yep. See, here's the thing. Possibly it was a rather famous building, eh? And painting the inside isn't the only isn't the only gorgeous thing. So is the building. I could just stare at it for all day. You betcha. Nice. Yeah. Here's the thing. Bees usually they'll keep on their own. You know, if you don't fuck with them. Yeah. Like if you see bees and flowers or whatever, that's all they want to do is just like get food. Yeah. Right? That's ba they're basically grocery shopping. Yeah. Because <laughs> they don't want to fuck with anyone. Wasps fucking want to fuck with people. Yeah. It sucks. <laughs> yes. So, outside of having to uh, avoid them all the time, one time I was about to, you know, get, get my rag from the from the bucket, and I was mm. going to you know, uh, wipe it down, wipe down the table. So I take the rag out, right? And guess what's attached to the oh, rag? Man. A wasp. Ugh, I'm already by getting... By a stinger. I'm already getting chills and cold. Still twitching. Ugh, I'm already getting cold sweats. It was dead, but for that split hot second... I had a fucking heart attack. I would too. I would probably have started crying. I'm not even kidding. I, I probably I, would have started crying. I don't blame you. Anyway, gone traveling. Sanctum Magic. You have to tell the story about how that wasp uh, went into your bedroom at Canvas Lodge. Did oh you tell that story God. already? I don't know if you have or haven't. Uh, it's kind of personal. Okay, that's fine. No way, this is super weak. What do we do? Ah, it is my dear Luigi. What are you doing on my doorstep, young fellow? It's like they're looking at the sign and you hear the voice behind you and you do that like... Uh, uh, and you turn around and you give the fake smile. Hi. <laughs> That's literally what this is. <laughs> hey there. What? You live here? So you're the sanctum manager? Wow, that's convenient. I totally thought you were a detective! I know, right? Good thing we made this guy our pal. Well, yes. That is more like a hobby of mine, if truth be told. <laughs> Mario's like... But enough chatter, hmm? Shall we go inside? Yes. Let's. I love his music, though. It's so fucking dorky and hilarious. I love it. <laughs> I will give him that. Yeah. It's such dorky-ass music. Ooh, the AC just kicked in. <laughs> and so just did the villains. Time. Aww. Wee! You're one, touch, you're one step too late. We have the crystal star! <laughs> Fucking dupless is too corporeal for this shit. Hey, don't leave without me. You gotta go through a God. fucking window in order Fuck. to catch up with these incorporeal <laughs> beings. Oh no! We're too late! <coughs> Ow. Ow. <clears throat> oh no! We're too late! We gotta go after them! I thought we were gonna have another, like, cough episode where you were sitting there just hacking your lungs up like you do <laughs> at least once every time we record. <laughs> just wait, just a second, Luigi. Exactly what is going on here? Speak quickly! You are a shitty manager! You just let somebody rob you! Hmm. In front of you! Ah, yes, quite rudimentary. So we were looking for the Crystal Star in this sanctum. Oh! Yes, very interesting. Well, no cause for worry. The Crystal Star is safe. Yes, quite safe indeed. Oh? The stone that our rude friend stole was fortunately a red herring! 
a fake! Mario's like, wow, that's actually kind of impressive. The real one is hidden somewhere in the sanctum to prevent such a theft. Yeah, video game characters that actually thought the fuck ahead. Never thought it would happen, right? Well, it happened with, Pen with Pennington. Remember that. You go, Pennington. However, as the two locations of the real Crystal Star, well, as a sector manager, I am, of course, prohibited from telling anyone. However, I do know where it is. Of that, you can be most certain, yes, indeed. Besides, I am sure a junior detective like yourself could find it on your own. Now, Luigi, put to use all the razor sharp studio skills I have taught you. Make me proud. Ay, mama fucking <laughs> Mia. Mama motherfucking Mia. Okay, so before we actually find the thing, there's an extra little secret I want to find here. Oh, really? Yeah, don't you remember the badge? Oh, that badge. Yeah. That might be in the... Uh, that might not be where you're... That might be a little later. No, it's here. Is it here? It's here. Okay, well, I'll look for it. If I know where it is... If I'm right in knowing where it... If words work, I will try and find it. I like how they like, uh, keep these little, like, star things here. Yeah, it's really nice and convenient. Yep, and yeah, just doing some platforming. Pretty it's neat a, stuff. That one. Yeah. Little oh fuck! I almost fell off the fucking edge. <laughs> oh. Have you ever done that? Mario. <laughs> Actually, that reminded me of uh, of a story of a tiny little tidbit of a story where I would I was like at the very end of this little puzzle where it's basically just all of this, right? Yeah. And it's like I was at the very last like. Having to, aha, ha ha ha, ha ha. Um, I was at the very end of having to do the this, and I fucking <laughs> did that. <laughs> no, <laughs> I I I started spinning a little too late, and I spanned and fell off the fucking thing. Oh, and that's I was like, perfect. God damn it, I gotta do it all over again. Mm. And that's basically a summation of my life in general. Great. Yeah, I think it's in the other thing. Okay. It's like later on. Because I, I think I know what you're talking about, but... It's, it's in the uh, next room, then. Yes. Yes. Whoa! Whoa, no way. There's a pipe in that painting. How weird. Huh. Huh. How do we uh, go there? See, this painting looks like it can swallow you whole. Oh, look at that. Oh, oh shit! That it is! It's a sanctum. It's in my sanctum. Sanctum stuff. I, I think, just like, what what is this painting world like? I don't know, but that that's... I I love the, uh... What's going on here. It's kind of a 64 plug-in, too, if you think about it. Yeah, kinda. I gotta find at least one of these things, because these this is the only place you find these booze. Really? Yeah. You don't find I them I think you else? find them in, uh, fucking, what is it? The, uh, last area? Yeah. But other than that, no. I saved you from spoilers. <laughs> I know, I remember one time I discussed it, and you were like, don't... Like, don't you fucking dare. Don't you fucking dare. You're like, what's a spoiler? I'm like, any future events. <laughs> I didn't know. That we haven't like, seen yeah. yet. I'm so used to, like, talking about this game from people who've played it that I automatically assume that everyone's played it. Sometimes to my demise. That's a dark boo. Purple just looks so wrong. These boos are so creepy. Max HP is 8, attack is 5, and defense is 0. So HP and attack are high, but they're just like normal boos otherwise. So just attack it like a normal boo. Get it before it turns invisible. I got you there, buddy boy. Good. <laughs> Good! Fuck. I thought it had its number. But it gave me a wrong one. Like your entire love life. Actually, yeah. <laughs> Have you ever had that happen to you? No, no you run that's the one thing that has has not happened to me Good. on my pursuit to find love. <laughs> Why'd you go for the one coin in this whole <laughs> I don't <laughs> know! <laughs> I got distracted by romance! <laughs> uh, none. <laughs> none? <laughs> You're a treasure. Oh, fuck. I thought that I... I missed. thought you actually escaped that. Me too. Let's skip this battle, shall we? Yeah. It's pretty redundant at this point. Yeah. Okay, so we're back. We're gonna do this, even though the crystal starts right there, because honestly, who the fuck is gonna think to go through the painting? Yeah. That was a question to everyone. If anyone has any answers, I'd love to hear. 
That wasn't sarcastic. I was just like, wh who do you think would guess this other than me? Oh, good point. Yeah, you would guess. I'm this. smart. You are smarticles. You wear smarticles, which are spectacles for smart people. Wait, wait. Is that? Yeah, it's on this side. See? Ah. Over yonder. Shine spray. And this over here too. Shine get. <laughs> Shine got it. Got <laughs> item. Got item. We need to play Mario Party again. Yeah. Dude, what was the freaking N64 time? Okay, you want to know what's a freaking weird-ass time in Mario's history other than all of it? What? <laughs> <laughs> well, we got an L emblem. You could change Mario's clothes into Luigi's clothes, so we could really be the super sleuth Luigi. Let's We're doing it. it. Anyway, you know that's on. hilarious to me, how the Luigi emblem is in the fucking place where he's like, this is Luigi. Yeah. And we're Luigi. Hello. Hi, it's a me. It's a me. Waku. Here we go. Gonna get a crystal star. Oh wait, this is the only crystal star that you voluntarily receive through a button command. Really? Everything else is in animation. Oh wait, title it. Oh yeah, that's right. Can I do that? Really? Oh, she doesn't activate. This it. must be the stick and resting place of the crystal star. Hmm, I wonder where it is. Based on his reactions, I say the P the Pennington didn't even know about this. Good. I know, when I thought about this, I was like, Gumbella freaking the fuck out, but... Yeah, every other Crystal Star, as far as I know, happens in the cutscene. Huh. So I think this is the only one that you voluntarily receive, so it's a little special to me. Yeah. It's like, the okay. Crystal Star is mine. You got the Crystal Star! <laughs> Your star power is now 7, and now Mario can use the special attack, Showstopper! Dude, I love this score so much. End of chapter! So were you going to tell a story, or...? No, you were. What the fuck was I going to say? About Mario's history? Anyway, Mario found the 6th oh, crystal I... star, unigraphically in the Postley Heights Sanctum. I got it now, I'll tell it after this. Only one crystal star remains. But our hero still does not know where Princess Peach is being held. Where could the last crystal star be? And where is Princess Peach being held? Hoping this crystal star might yield answers, Mario and friends return to Pennington. Basically, I just think that, um... Have you ever played my Have you played Mario Kart DS recently? Yes. The character models are just... God-awful? <laughs> just beautiful. <laughs> Honestly. So bad! Especially Bowser. E even back in the day when those graphics were the norm, I was like, this looks terrible. <laughs> Even especially Bowser. Bowser's my favorite. No, no, Donkey Kong. Oh, He's, yeah. He has a permanent fucking like, like, mm. <laughs> guys, I can't close my lips. <laughs> Should I get these? Well, how much do I only have 51? I don't care that not that much. I was gonna be like, should I just defeat all of them? But that's gonna be ridiculously redundant. I'm not gonna do that to you guys. Fucking penitents. Like, where's this pipe go? I have become the Luigi. <laughs> hmm, so that's where it was. Wait a minute, you're green. So you must be the revolutionary Mario. Of course. Mario just like pulls out a gun from his hand. <laughs> I swear to fucking God. And puts the barrel in his mouth. Oh, well, nothing, nothing. Just talking to my brain. All oh, geniuses do it. He clicks once. There's no shot. And he's like... Here I was hoping you would be the end. <laughs> I've loaded one. I've given it a 1-6 chance. <laughs> We're fucking Russian roulette. I'm playing Russian roulette with life right now. Congratulations, Luigi. You found the real crystal star. At least it's calling me by the right fucking name. So please, feel free to take it. I'll just put another fake one over here. Does he make them for a living? Is he also a glass sculptor? Yes. Well, what traveling are you? with you has been rather hectic, but I do admit rather fun as well. I'm sure you still have a long road ahead, Luigi, but do not give up. Well, thanks, buddy. I'm gonna get out of here. Can I go through this window? I wish I could. Alright, well, how about next time on alternate buttons? Oh, yeah, we should do that. <laughs> yeah, next time! <laughs>